calculating the net torque on an object with multiple forces acting on it. A boy of mass 45 kilograms and his dog of mass 25 kilograms stand on a diving board. If the boy stands 2 meters from the pivot of the board and the dog stands 1.2 meters from the pivot, what is the net torque? Let's call this the pivot point and let's draw a, a diving board. We have a boy standing at the edge of the diving board or 2 meters away from the diving board. So that would be, uh, that'd be boy. And then we have a, a dog. I'm not going to draw a dog. It's embarrassing. So we're just going to have a dog standing about 1.2 meters from the, uh, from the pivot. Here's a little tail. Okay, I did my best. Now, uh, what we need to do is, since they're both standing on the same side of the pivot, they're both applying torques uh, of the, in the same direction. So they're both applying uh, torque uh, downwards on the, on the pivot. So to figure out the net torque, all we need to do is add up the individual torques for the dog and for the boy. Now, we don't have any angle information here, so we're going to have to use the second formula for torque, which is R times the perpendicular component of force. So let's go ahead and uh, solve this for the boy and then for the dog. So for the boy, it's pretty simple. The only force that he's applying to the, uh, the diving board, he's directly applying, is, is caused by the force of gravity pulling down on the boy uh, and thus um, creating a contact force between the boy and the, and the diving board. So the, the force, the perpendicular force, is going to be equal to the boy's mass. So it's going to be equal to mg, which is equal to 45 times 9.8. And that gives you a value of 441 newtons. Um, the same thing goes for the dog. We're going to use the dog's mass this time, and that's uh, 25 kilograms times 9.8, and that gives you a force value of 245 newtons. Okay, now all we're going to do is uh, apply the rest of the formula. So we have uh, tau equals uh, r uh, perpendicular component of force, and that's going to be equal to uh, 2.0 times 441 for the boy, and that's going to be equal to um, 1.2 times 245 for the dog. And uh, we get values of 882, 882 newton meter for the boy, and 294 newton meter for the dog. And all we're going to do is to figure out the net torque we're just going to add these two values together, 882 for the boy plus 294 for the dog. And we get a final, final value of 1,176 newton meters uh, of net torque for the dog and the boy combined.